What is going on everyone? Enzo here. Hope you guys are all having a great day. We are going to get into a Champions League game in this episode, but first uh, Irving Lozano and PSV, but first some Serie A action versus Fiorentina. Early on here, Dzeko snapshot right around the post. Fiorentina had a lot of good young players last year, but for some reason... I don't know, never put it all together consistently throughout the year. They have Milankovic in defense, who we've actually swiped. Chiesa, who we've swiped as well. Simeone right here on the break, on his right foot. No defense whatsoever. Amazing save by Handanovic. Point blank range. Inter going back the other way. Brozovic. Chiesa on the wing. Simeone is Diego Simeone's son, by the way, if nobody knew that. Brozovic, left foot, fires it into the bottom corner. He shoots and scores. 1-0 for Inter over Fiorentina, who I'm personally familiar with as a Roma fan last year. They crushed a 7-1 in the Coppa Italia. Embarrassing effort in that game, but Fiorentina looked phenomenal. Back to FIFA, though. Brozovic on the left buries it into the bottom corner. I don't know. I think he's playing in this game. Fiorentina have an excellent young keeper, too. Lafont in goal. He's only like 20 or 21. Oh, ridiculous skill right there. Dzeko cuts inside. Does the defender. Shoots. Blocked. Left foot. Second effort. The big Bosnian bomber scores in the bottom corner. Gives Inter the 2-0 lead. Yeah, I, I think I think that's Lafont in goal. He's he's an uh, a great goalie in only 2021. I hope Fiorentina was allowed to keep him. Jetko cuts inside on the right, blocked on the left. Can't stop the second one. Fiorentina with the new ownership change too. This year they were bought by I think he's a billionaire. I don't know, but hopefully he's able to inject some cash into the club. Great city, great team. Chiesa, Dzeko. Oh, that looked like it had the makings of a goal. Chiesa, the former Fiorentina man versus old club. Been an amazing signing for us. Barella, Dzeko, Lukaku. Chiesa gets open on this wing all day long with this pace. Wide open. Dzeko scores his second of the game. We are rolling right now. Absolutely crushing Fiorentina. 3-0. Not even to halftime yet. We're celebrating like we won the Champions League right there, but that's okay. Conte loves the passion and enthusiasm. Dzeko on the outside of his right foot. Snaps it right into the bottom corner. Giovanni Simeone coming the other way here. Morales on the right foot. Shoots Handanovic equal to the task. Eseret cuts one inside. Handanovic again. The old man has still got it. Again, third one in a row. Andonovic, where is my defense, bro? Well, we Fiorentina, Morales. Into the second half here, Lukaku goes for a long drive just over the net. Azamoa, Dzeko on the right foot. Curves one out to Chiesa. Chiesa on that right wing. Into Lu Lukaku, into the top corner. Manages to drift off the defender. 4-0. Chiesa might have assisted, has assisted at least a couple of the goals in this game. He's been excellent down that right-hand side all game long. Clips one out wide. Chiesa picks it up. Whips one right into the middle. Lukaku into the top corner. Trying not to fall back on uh, on cheesy headers with Lukaku and Jeku, but they're, they're so good at it in this game, especially with Chiesa. Oh, Lotaro on the right foot, right at Lafont. Trying not to fall back on it, but Chiesa's pace out wide, and then Lukaku and Jeku in the middle. It really plays into our strength. Chiesa drives another one low. Lafont. Top of the box, Gerson, I believe has recently gone back to Brazil. One time Roma player, loaned out to Fiorentina, might have gone back to Brazil. Solid player, but I don't know. I guess uh, just not ready for the next level yet. Maybe just need some more time. He's good in spurts. Anyway, that is gonna wrap up this game. We crush Fiorentina 4-0 on our home soil. The San Siro is going nuts. Perfect day for him and his team. But Zella doesn't know whether to laugh or cry. <laughs> See, uh, next game is going to be versus Cagliari. I don't know if you guys see at the bottom there, Lukaku tied for the league lead in goals. We are third in the table with 15. Martinez and Politano are going to lead the line in this game as we want to save up. Save up our stars for Lartado early on the right foot. Save. We want to save up our stars for the Champions League clash with PSV. Politano, top of the box. Milankovic, a defender's touch. Swiped by Pavaletti, Sanabria. Leading the break. 
It's like a five on five. Clips one out wide. Terrible defending by Sensi. Not known for his aerial ability. Kelly clip one in. And that was a total disaster all the way around. It was a disaster from top to bottom. Pavoletti stole the ball at the top of his own 18. Finished with a header. That is what you want to see from Cagliari's standpoint. Amazing play. Very good build up, Alan. Very Started good with Milenkovic trying to control the ball at the top of the box. Cagliari clips it in. Pavoletti clips one into the far corner. Trying to get that one back. Sensi on his right foot trying to atone. Saved by Rafael. The ensuing corner into Azamoa. Or that's Kate the Balde, sorry. Passes it in. Sensi again. Similar spot on the other side. Oh, last ditch. Amazing defending from Caleri. Must have blocked this with his toenail. Oh, what a heroic effort right there. Ensuing corner from Borja. Going to go short. Politano. Not going to give it to Milenkovic again. Yes, we do. Milenkovic. Get rid of it. Ranocchia. I got to switch that up so defenders aren't at the top of the box with the ball. Lataro on his right foot. On his right foot. Still open. Goes back the other way. Rafael is not equal to it. He shoots and scores in the bottom corner. One to one. Does the little Argentine. Tango. Salsa. I don't know. One dance from the other. But looks fun either way. Right through the defender's legs. All the way back across the goal into the far corner. It's so hard once he, once a goalie gets moving one direction. It's so hard to dive all the way back the other. Jao Pedro in a sea of defenders. Finds the open man. Finds the open man. Oh, we were completely undone there. But Hendanovic bails us out. Terrible pass. Oh, and we got lucky right there. Fiorentina. Still almost to the end of the first half here. Give and go, give and go. Handanovic bails us out again, and we are getting torn apart by feisty Sardinians here. That one could have gone anywhere. Handanovic again. It's been maybe our star of the season so far. Has kept us in so many games. Games we haven't been playing well. Handanovic has completely been keeping us in it. See Cagliari on the break again. Where is the defense? Pavoletti. Sanabria. Can he find the open man? Pavoletti. Back inside. Oh! We had to make the latch dish. We had to do it. They had a wide open shot. Maybe not uh, at the time. And that's a red all day long for Joachim Anderson. Completely obliterates his man. That's always a penalty in a sending off. <laughs> Don't know what he could possibly be complaining to the ref about. Let's see. Handanovic, the hero, finds the right direction. Again, probably the MVP of the season so far for us. We would have so many drop points without him. Terrible giveaway in the midfield. It's a two-on-one. Sanabria shoots. Handanovic again. Gagliarini, Politano. Into Otaro. What are you doing? Have you ever heard of a left foot guy? Guy, just shoot it on your left foot. What the hell is that? Dalbert into Politano. Otaro. Keita Balde. On his left. Can't find the right angle. Not enough space. Oh no. Oh shit. <laughs> Sanabria. Gagliardini's injured. It's a three on one. Fio Cagliari completely blow it. He goes for the hero's effort instead of passing the ball. His teammates are definitely not talking to him after the game. Sanabria saved by Handanovic. How have Cagliari not scored? Lataro. By the way, guys, I know my pronunciation isn't perfect either, but it's not Cagliari. It's not Cagliari. So please stop saying that. It, it hurts my ears. It's it's at least say the the G L is silent in Italian. It's not Cag... I can't even... You guys say it so wrong, I can't even say it that way. Cag... It's not Cagliari. Anyway, just had to say that. <laughs> We're gonna go into our uh, P is match with PSV here. Gonna put our star-studded lineup back in. Dzeko, Lukaku, Azamoa, Vecino, Brozovic, Barella, Chiesa, Godin, Skriniar, Devry at the back, Kandanovic in goal. Early on here, Chiesa all the way across. Azamoa, PSV, a very underrated team. They were excellent last year. They took points off many of the big teams. They took points off both Inter and Spurs. 
in the group stage. Chiesa, Barella. Barella curls one into the far corner. He shoots and scores and puts Inter up. 1-0 in the Champions League. Does the old dead fish flop. Barella, Bar Barella has really been coming to life for us lately. Say this beautiful shot right here. Just curls it all the way into the far corner. He's been working on his shooting in practice. Puts Inter up 1-0 in the Champions League. Really got to watch out for Irving Lozano. But right now it's Pereiro. Wide open. <laughs> Tries to go. Felt the defenders on his tail. Tried to take it early. Just wide. Hendanovic. Pereiro. And that's going to loop into the back corner. Praying for an offsides there. Isn't going to come. It's going to put it 1-1. Don't want to be dropping points here. Beautiful save by Hendanovic. He can't do everything though. Need some more defensive help on that effort. Still towards the end of the first half here. Don't freeze. Lozano is the danger man. We got to watch out for the excellent Mexican national. Pro could be going to Napoli. I hope so. I'd love to see him come to Serie A. It's nice to see some other teams other than Juve pick up some of these stars. Vecino off the post. Lukaku the follow-up effort. No. How did we not score there? PSV coming the other way. Going for goal of the century. Lozano. I gotta follow, see, check on that deal. I, I heard they were he was taking a medical or they agreed a fee or something, but I, I really hope Napoli does end up with him. Latado on his right foot, weaves in, weaves out wide. Don't want to drop points here. Oh, Skriniar is way too slow. Oh, terrible effort right there by Mabel. Mabil, Mabel, not too sure. Header, nothing. Not getting a lot going here. Into the 86th minute. Oh no, we're really pushing for that next goal, trying to get all three points. We've left ourselves exposed. Lozano clips one into Romero. That's not Romero, it's Mabel again. Shoots. I don't know, just get it out. Wasn't sure who that was. Letado bloops one over the goal. Can we have a dramatic late winner? No, nothing. Skriniar, defender's touch. And we're gonna go ahead and drop points here. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode. You're definitely going to want to tune in tomorrow as we have two big clashes. One, we have the Derby della Madonnina with uh, AC Milan, classic derby. And we also have a Champions League match with Messi and Barcelona. Hope you guys have a great day. Hope to see you guys again tomorrow. Go ahead and like and subscribe if you want or if you can. If not, that's cool too. Go ahead and leave a comment down below because that helps. I hope you guys have a great day. Later.